Hey everybody, Jason here. RPG a day 2019, day and word prompt number 23. And that word is surprise. Uh, surprise. Um, <clears throat> man, I don't know. I'm, I don't know about that one. Kind of like lost from yesterday. At first, oh, excuse me. Woo. I was not sure about lost, uh, but it came to me pretty quick. Uh, surprise, I don't know anything about surprise. Um, you know, you know, these days it's hard to surprise uh, players with anything because um, very, very little is new original in the world anymore. So it's hard to surprise people that way, I think. Uh, as a as a player, things that would surprise me are <laughs> people changing their attitude about how they role play, how they play the characters, things like that. Story surprises for me, uh, I don't know that I would be too terribly surprised by story ideas or arcs or things like that. Um, but, <sighs> excuse me, surprise, uh, you know, one thing I, you know, don't really do in role-playing games, um, in D&D, especially uh, the games we're playing in now, is, you know, back when we, had, when we played second edition, uh, AD&D, we used surprise rolls a decent bit. We don't use surprise rolls anymore. Um, we don't use surprise rolls for combat. We don't use, uh, we don't use uh, morale rolls anymore. It's always a fight to the death, which is silly. Uh, things would make more, a lot more sense if we use morale, uh, both for the players and the, the, the stuff we're fighting, things we're fighting. But uh, surprise... <sighs> uh, I'm so sorry, everybody. I'm so tired. Uh, but surprise is something we don't really roll for anymore in D&D. You know, you don't. We don't usually try to get the jump on people. Uh, we scout a little bit in our games, um, but that's usually in an effort to prepare for a fight that might be coming up ahead. But even then, we don't use uh, scouted information to surprise uh, enemies or other groups of uh, things to fight or, or whatever. Um, which is silly, I guess. Maybe we should do that. But oh, God. It would be surprising right now if I woke up. That'd be a real surprise. Uh, gosh, I don't know. This is a tough one, and I really apologize to you guys for rambling for five minutes about surprise. Uh, maybe. Uh, oh, you know what? Yeah, I know what I could say for sure. This is not going to be a long video or a long segment. Surprise is I will, I plan on surprising my players, my, I'm sorry, my group um, uh, with uh, a game. Or there's a couple of games I would like to surprise them with, put it that way, after our uh, D&D 5th uh, edition campaign is over with. I would love to surprise them with a uh, horror-themed uh, one-shot for Halloween, uh, possibly using the slasher flick system, uh, or... No, I guess I wouldn't. Well, yeah, for that. Uh, I've also been working on my own uh, horror-themed uh, game game system, uh, somewhat inspired by Slasher Flick. But I would also love to surprise them with a uh, 1980s TSR Marvel uh, one-shot, uh, actually set in the 80s. Um, I wanted to, to actually run, surprise them with one of those things and run that for them back when Stan Lee died. Um, a few months back and it never really came to fruition um, but I think if I ever surprised them with a uh, Marvel superheroes game um, it would obviously it would, it would definitely be dedicated to Stan Lee um, I wouldn't be who I am today without Stan Lee um, and I know this surprise video has uh, unsurprisingly veered off course and off topic into something else but yeah, I, I, I would love to surprise my, my group with a couple of games to run for them, them not expecting or knowing what it is that I would be running for them, a couple one-shots. And I think uh, 
anybody out there who's running games, who's GMing games, um, take a minute to think about something that you've never played before with your group um, or played at all and take a moment to think about surprising your group with something, uh, a new game, a new system, a new scenario, something that's unexpected. Surprise them with something unexpected gaming-wise and uh, see what sort of spontaneous fun happens with uh, that surprise. And let me know. Make a video about it. Make a you know put some comments below. Make your own video about it, and, and, and uh, you know tell the world how it went. Surprise your players next next time you go to play a game. Surprise your players in some way. Uh, further down the line, maybe a couple months from now, or a couple weeks or se sessions from now, as a GM, show up at the table and say. Okay, we were supposed to play this this weekend because we've been in this long-running campaign, but surprise, I brought something new for you guys to play. And we're just going to have some fun and see how that goes. And uh, let me know. Come back here and do a response for me. Anyway, that is surprise for uh, RPG Day 2019. Um, I'm sure this video made no sense. Uh, surprise, surprise. And thanks for watching if you got this far. Um, if you didn't get this far, I certainly don't blame you. And I uh, hope you're having uh, good games, good gaming sessions, and uh, a good RPG a day 2019. All right, peace out.